What is up? I'm Wanted Turtle, and today we have another Pokemon opening. We've got opened up, uh, I think like a case of these already, but we have two more Trainer's Toolkits. Best sealed products that I can think of as far as competitive play goes. Right in the boxes, everything you need to build a powerful deck. Um, not exactly true. I do feel like Zach would say, hey, get the Pika Rom League Battle Deck, one of these, and then that is a very accurate statement. Um, one of the more common questions on our stream is, all right, how do I start as a new player? And that typically is my answer. I think like the re most recent example, I think that's what Winter Winter BT, shout outs to you. I believe that's what uh, he did. And um, yeah, he's like, oh, I finally built the standard deck and uh, thought like, all right, I can bring my, my silly Meowth deck to this battle and I got destroyed. So yeah, such a good product. Uh, double Dedenne, double boss, a uh, whole bunch of other really useful trainers, some cool alternate arts. And the reason why we actually open this on videos versus the Pika Rom deck is like, this actually has some packs in it. So at least there actually is a opening. So here we go, let me see, this thing. All right, so I imagine everyone has seen this before, but you got your typical stuff from ETBs. You got some, I do like these sleeves. I like the way they look. I've, I've mentioned this before, but I feel like they're a little bit bigger than like the typical ETB sleeves. And I don't know, a big thing of energies, which doesn't really matter. And then this is the main prize. So much good stuff in here, including those double Dedenne's. And you got four packs, uh, which everything is like standard legal and will be even after rotation. So awesome product all overall, through and through. But uh, all right, we gotta want to do this video a few, make a few announcements. I've been kind of like alluding to this for some time. It is finally time to celebrate the fact that we did hit 1,000 subs on YouTube. We did hit that a while ago. Uh, actually, we'll just open one of these. And uh, the reason I've been kind of stalling is to basically get closer to the release of Darkness Ablaze. So basically we're close enough and I'm not really sure when I'll start to get products. A uh, number of vendors are saying that they'll ship as soon as they can, including things like uh, pre-release kits. Some people are saying even booster boxes. Um, so maybe we can like basically deliver on that giveaway sooner uh, than basically the release date of the set, which is mid August. All right, here is this amazing product. You got two of these guys and the alternate art is awesome. You know, I've, we're still not sure what's gonna come in like the summer sets. I think it was released that it's gonna be like V boxes, or V tins or whatever. So it might be, you know, alternate arts for Vs. These guys are actually pretty well centered. I wouldn't mind getting a couple of these graded, but then you have super useful supporters. This guy, man, we could not pull him for anything in Rebel Clash. These are the alternate art, quick ball, a lot of useful cards. And um, even like the special energies, there's another alternate arts and Pokemon communication. So amazing stuff right there. Can't lose with this product. Like if nothing's in these, it doesn't matter. You still win. All right, let's see. Let's go Sword and Shield, Unbroken Bonds, and finally Rebel Clash. And um, all right, so 1,000 sub celebration. It's going to consist of two things. I uh, imagine one thing that most people are excited about is going to be a giveaway. So... Um, depending on where like the winner's at, uh, they might have some options if they are within the US. I think most likely I can do, you know, you can pick between a Darkness Ablaze booster box or um, I'm not sure how many I'm thinking, like 10 of those double packs, I think from my end would probably cost the same amount. The reason to consider those double packs though is you get 20 Darkness Ablaze, which that's the new set, but also 20 Sword and Shield. So you get fewer Darkness Ablaze, but might be worth it. A lot of good cards still in Sword and Shield. Ooh, Professor's Research, not bad. I think even Research comes in here, but uh, at least we got a foil version. Is Research in here? Yep, you even get Research. So as far as the staple, um, the staple supporters and such, you got them all. Into Sword and Shield, but I think the reason I'm excited to open those double packs, open a bunch of Sword and Shield, you got that Gold Zacian that's still going, like still worth a lot, and. Uh, the one I definitely want to get the playset of would be those secret rare quick balls. Also in the, or not the secret rare, but the base version is in the toolkit as well. 
All right, let's see how we do here. But then the other portion of the celebration will comprise uh, basically a Q and A. Uh, oh my gosh, pulling a lot of useful supporters. Once we start getting the Rebel Clash, if now is finally the time when we start finding those bosses, that would be very, uh, we'll celebrate it. <laughs> Even though it's like a little late after we opened, I don't know, like a case worth of uh, packs. All right, on to Unbroken Bonds. So there are, appears to be have been not a reprint, but they started uh, pumping out those three-pack blisters. I'll leave a link down below in the description. Uh, you can pick up two three-pack blisters, so six packs off of Game Nerds for 22. Um, you know, like I think boxes have been going for like 250. Uh, oh my gosh, we're getting hit a lot of hits. Uh, Hunch Crow, it feels a little off-center, but we will take it. Actually, sleeve you up as well. Actually, was this a card? Uh, I think it has the ability along this Pokemon is your active Pokemon. Your opponent can't play any tool or uh, tool special energy or stadium cards from their hand. I think Andy, shout out to Andy, uh, used it for some kind of lock. Um, so I couldn't put down my double dragon energy to expand it. But yeah, we'll do a Q&A, so if you do have any questions that you've had for me, uh, obviously there'll be a handful of things that I won't answer, but anything that I do am comfortable discussing, I will address them in a video. Alright, let's see what else we have to announce. I think uh, I should get it tomorrow, a very special like mail coming in. I'm really excited to show you guys. I'm not sure when that video will go down. and. Um, Actually, we're going to start in prep for Darkness Ablaze. I'm thinking about we're going to try to do some live openings again. Did those for a little bit, but then kind of like it was like the the lull after Darkness Ab or Rebel Clash. So let's capitalize the hype of Darkness Ablaze and start setting up, start setting so people get used to the idea of live openings. Right now, I'm thinking Friday. Just a scissor on our first Rebel Clash pack. Let's see, I guess the biggest thing we could find here at this point would just be Dragapults. No longer need those very desired bosses. So yeah, um, this Friday looking to do one. If you, uh, the easiest way to just track is just join the Discord. I'll make an announcement there as far as what the plan is once that settles. But yeah, to summarize, big giveaway coming in the near future. Q&A. If you have any questions you can dm me on discord put in a comment or something i'll try to be good about aggregate them all through the various sources and <laughs> what we mentioned in the beginning new to the game how do i get started one of these toolkits picaram deck uh, league battle deck uh you just want to play online you can pick up those code cards i think this one you could pick up for like five dollars i'm not sure what a picaram code card goes for maybe a little bit more but um, and then you're 90% of the way there. Wow, double these flapples. All right, last pack. We did we did get one GX hit and two professor's researches. I suppose if I could choose, I would take those over the non foils. And it's kind of nice to have extra ones. So if you do construct multiple decks, you don't have to like. All right, let me resleeve all the researches, uh, all the Dedennies, whatever. All right, can we get something on this last pack, Snover? Pidov, Darumaka, Hatena, Scyther, a sword is our reverse, and then just a Mandibuzz. So we only get one hit out of the packs, but once again, we don't need anything. I took a look on eBay. I think these guys are going for like five, six dollars per piece uh, shipped, and then like the code card again is like what five, five, six dollars as well. So even like if you break it apart and you just sell the pieces, like that's that's late, but like. You still have some cards left over after making a majority of the cost of the box back. So that's going to be it for us today. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Thank you for all the support on all the various platforms, YouTube, Twitch, everyone in the Discord. Uh, huge shout out to all my patrons out there. I'm Wanna Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.